YouTube, Double D, Derek Dimes, DefeatTheBook.com. Let us help you beat the odds if you're new to the channel. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you go down below, click the bell, subscribe. You're going to want to be notified as we are on a very, very nice free pick run. 24 and 13, our last 37. Want to continue to build upon that momentum. Want to continue to give you guys free pick winners. Win, lose, or draw. You're going to get it all. If you go to DefeatTheBook.com, the link's down here. In the description, you scroll down, you'll be able to see the pick history. I'm telling you, it's not nice. It has not been pretty. I have one on a, a horrible little run here in their premium selection plays. We want to add a one and two day yesterday, free pick hit for us. And then I've had so many baseball games lose by an error. We had one yesterday. There was an error in the game that scored the only run in the game. So we ended up losing on an error, essentially, but struggling there. And then I can't believe I was on the nets as well. And Durant just looks tired, if I'm going to be honest, you know, and, and I think all those minutes are catching up to him and catching up to Kyrie. They've been playing 40 plus minutes since they've been back together and playing every single game. And honestly, I think Steve Nash is in well over his head in this series. Watch out for a Boston possible sweep unless they're going to get Ben back and Ben hasn't played in ages. And even when he did play, he looked like hot trash. So one and two day yesterday, looking to get back on the horse today. Um, and get things rolling. Four picks out today. Card's going to be out shortly. Feeling great about it. Been up for a while last night and this morning. Trying to get things back rolling. So let's get you guys a free pick right here and get right into it so we can get you on track for another free pick winner. Not sure how many in a row. We strung together a nice little bit in a row here. Four or five in a row. Um, we'll have to take a look at that. But let's get you a pick here in the NBA. Minnesota Timberwolves, Memphis Grizzlies are sitting at one and a half, moving up to two now, favoring the Grizzlies there uh, on the road against the Timberwolves. I know the regular season, pretty much they beat each other um, at their respective home places. And I think we've seen the Grizz, the real Grizz to me in game two. Now, the issue for the for the Timberwolves is going to be finding that third score. And and I think they need to put out a, a Morse code or something for D'Angelo Russell because he has not played well. Combined five for 22 in both of the game one and game two, five for 22, really struggling to get off here in this series. Um, but I think the, the combination of him finding a third score, the first game it was Beasley had 23, second game he only had seven. And they uh, sometimes lean on McDaniels also. He only uh, had two points there in game two. So they got to find that third score. It seems that Anthony Edwards is really the only consistent cog they have right now offensively. And they're asking him to do a lot of work offensively and defensively cat non-existent in game two i just i'm just not seeing a lot of points in this one the total will sit at 237 moving down 236 and a half we're going to take a look at this under the total here in this one i think it's going to be a lot more physical i expect to see um uh timberwolves really trying to get after the offensive glass they got dominated 14 to 4 in offensive rebounds in the last game and something also to keep an eye on is steven adams hasn't played a lot of minutes right only 23 minutes i believe in the first game hardly any rebounds three second game he only played three minutes total um so you see these guards really having to do a lot on the glass john morant had nine rebounds for the memphis grizzlies in that game but i think for the timberwolves to stay in this they're going to have to they're going to have to find a third score and they're going to have to rebound the ball a little bit better offensively i'm looking at this total and i'm going to go under the total timberwolves and grizzlies under 236 and a half is my official free pick of the day this is a premium selection play um for me, it is on my personal card. I do have four selections here today, looking to get back on the horse, feeling really confident and looking to, ready to get off the schneid here a little bit, right? So yeah, official free pick, Timberwolves, Grizzlies, under 236 and a half, the official free pick of the day. Guys, let me know if you agree, you disagree, whatever the case may be, put your pick down below. Let's get some discussion rolling. And as always, guys, best of luck if you decide to tail. It's Derek, da -da 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 dimes, defeat the book.com. Let us help you beat the odds. Heads up, Bryce will probably have NASCAR. He's going to be at Talladega. So NASCAR card will be up. NASCAR pack will be up um, Very uh, this weekend, probably Friday, Saturday. I'm not sure exactly, but be on the lookout for NASCAR. He will have some NASCAR bets out very, very soon, guys. Make sure you guys have a great Thursday, a blessed Thursday. Best of luck if you decide to.